Hi, how y'all doing today? It's snowing here in Ontario, Canada. Cloud covered. They blanketed the sky out again. I had flu a little bit. A little bit of sun came through. Some cracks, which was pretty. It's always nice to see the sun, but it didn't last for long, right? It's been on and off, on and off. What's today? January the twenty fourth, twenty twenty three. Yeah, seven in numerology. So, a good number. It is. So I was watching a video done about the doomsday clock, and I was reading about it on the internet. All right? And everything, you know, that we see is put out to promote fear. It is. All right? Even the words. All right? It's to make you feel it. So after reading up about the doomsday clock, my intuition tells me that, okay, it got put 90 seconds closer to, or 90 seconds to midnight, okay, and the doomsday clock is to warn them about pandemics, nuclear war, climate change, or if you're a free thinker and open-minded, you know those things aren't real. They're manipulated by the governments and the Illuminati. Cabal, whatever you want to call them. Pieces of shit. Right? And, yeah. So, it got started, invented in 1947, this clock. Okay? And they get to turn it forward or backward, whatever they want. Right? They made up their own little club, their own little group of people, you know, from, you know, the United States to, to make this thing. Right? And run it and decide, you know, who gets to do what with it, okay? Just like they do with the world, okay? So what it means to me is, they say, what was it? The, the video I was watching, she says it means it's uh, 90 days, okay? Till doomsday. The Armageddon. The rapture, right? So why would they make a clock like that in the first place? To scare you, to get you to live in a lower vibration of fear and to believe those things Nuclear war, climate change, all this shit really exists, right? Yeah, brainwashing, hypnosis, okay? So if you flip it around, because we're in a satanic realm, remember? It's their alarm clock. They are the ones that only got 90 days left. It's not about man and womankind. It's for them, the corrupt, the soulless, the ones that run everything. Right? So this is pretty good news if you think about it. Right? It, to me, it is. It raises my vibration. Because I see the truth. I do. So, yeah. That puts us in April sometime. Right? How many more of the government's going to fall? What's going to happen? Right? I'd like to see the bad guys get taken out. Even if we don't know what they really look like, they're Zionists that are afraid of people and think they're better than us, the ones that run this realm, right? They won't come out of their little hidey holes. Are you kidding me? They're scared of us. Really, they are. That's why they have to have, you know, people in power, like people that look like they're in power, like prime ministers and presidents and uh, 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 spiritual leaders and uh, 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 heads of scientists and stuff like this, Okay. Those are all their puppets. Nothing left. Nothing more. Right? They only know what they're told. And what they're told to say. And how they're told to act. Right? Yeah. So it is good news. I like to see what's going to happen in 90 days. See these POSs get taken off the realm. That'd be so cool, wouldn't it? So we get back to Mother Nature and live life the way we're meant to. Right? Because what do people want? Ordinary men and women kind. What do they want? They want to be in love. They want to raise their family and they want to be happy. They don't care about all this other shit that the government, you know, puts in your mind that you want to have war with this country because they hurt that country and they're hurting these people. You don't know. You're not there. You're only listening to what they say. Right? And you have no proof. Just their word. Why should we take their word for anything? They're liars. Parliament. To speak lies. For real. All right. Hopefully, 
the energy keeps on getting better. Drink a lot of water. Stay hydrated, okay? Look after yourself. Love you. It's looking. It's loving yourself. Make sure you read the ingredients on the stuff you eat. If you can't, if you don't know what that word means, it ain't food. It's not, right? Go back to natural, eating from the earth. That's what I think's best, anyways. So, all right. I love you all as a consciousness. Enjoy the rest of your night or day. Okay? Okay. Bye.